Disney employees celebrated the triumphant return of Mr. Incredible CEO Bob Iger less than eight weeks ago. But they might see him as more of a scar or Jafar today. Iger, who's already signaled cost cutting, will be top of mind of the new year, now says it's time to return to the office. Starting March 1st, employees are expected to be back four days a week. The boss writing in a memo obtained by Yahoo Finance, quote, in a creative business like ours, nothing can replace the ability to connect, observe, create with peers that comes from being physically together, nor the opportunity to grow professionally by learning from leaders and mentors. Shauna, your reaction? You know, it's going to be interesting to see what the employee's reaction yeah. is because we have s cited study after su study saying how important it is for workers to have that flexibility. They want to work from home. There was a recent ZipRecruiter survey out saying that employees are willing to take a 14% pay cut just to be able to work from home. So I think the big question here is who has the upper hand? Is it still the employee, which has certainly been the case leading up until now because we know hiring has been so challenging, quitting has been so popular. That dynamic though is starting to shift and it seems like the employer is going to have and will have the upper hand as we do uh, uh, potentially the, the economic backdrop continues to worsen. They are forced to do layoffs. Employees won't be able to ask for what they had in the past. They won't be able to get away with what they've been getting yeah. away with in the, in the past if, in fact, their boss's management wants everyone back to the office. Yeah, that same study showed you're three times as more like you'll get three times as many applicants for remote work as yeah. you will uh, in office. I think there's a real test of the very signature quality that everyone hailed when Bob Iger came back. It's that deft personal touch in handling employees, in handling the media, and handling politicians. My presumption is that if the same statement came from Bob Chapek, it would probably not be taken as well as it might be from Bob Iger, but that's part of why they brought him back. Now, the actual statement that he wrote in that email, I have to agree with spot on. What he needs is collaboration. What he needs is employees learning from mentors, people seeing each other face to face and building on that. And quite frankly, from this seat, four days a week sounds awfully nice, it right? Does. Now, it doesn't sound day, great. Yeah, nice. <laughs> it doesn't sound great to a lot of those that, that are used to the two and three day. But look, you're still getting a full day at home working from remote, which is more than you probably ever thought possible prior to the pandemic. So we'll see how employees react to your yeah, point. Yeah, I think that it makes a very strong case, but yeah. we'll see. I don't know how they're going to react.